Welcome back to Atalan. Armed with the Macran Crystal and the Muonic Inducer, you will. But there is little choice in the matter now. You are the last hope of defeating Doctor Doom. Should you fail, all is lost. I have interfered too much already. Or so my brethren believe. They have taken steps to prevent me from any further action. Because I saved you from death at Doctor Doom's hand, my people have nullified my powers. I could no longer aid you even if I wanted to. We are Watchers, which means we are sworn not to affect any kind of change, no matter how small. Yes, but I am certain in time my people will see reason and restore my powers. But until then, I am helpless. You are quite welcome. Welcome back. I understand you had a little excitement during your mission to Shi'ar. The situation on Earth has grown considerably worse. Doctor Doom has easily crushed any resistance. It would appear you are Earth's last hope. This places even more importance on your acquiring the Muonic Inducer. This device is used by Galactus when he consumes a planet. He is currently in the beginning stages of consuming a planet populated by the Skrull. Galactus is an entity of enormous powers. Born at the destruction of one universe, and during the birth of ours, he wields immense cosmic energy. Because of his incredible power, Galactus needs to devour entire planets to sustain himself. He uses a herald to search ahead and find planets suitable for consumption. They are a much older race than we are, having been capable of space flight for millions of years. Originally, they were peaceful merchants. Then, they met the Kree. The Kree are a race of warriors. So to protect themselves, the Skrull were forced to become warriors themselves. Now, violence and conquest are a way of life for the Skrull. Many times, and because of it, the Skrull have created various warriors in their Super Skrull program, in ways. But the Super Skrull program is much more intensive, and sometimes takes volunteers against their will. But it has created a number of powerful warriors, such as Pybok and Super Skrull. You are welcome. Hi, Tony. Sounds like you guys had some fun in the Shi'ar Empire. Hello, Hank. One of these missions, you should come with us. It's a device Galactus uses when he consumes a planet. It converts the vast energy into something he can assimilate. The Inducer will allow you to safely absorb Doom's stolen god power. Without it, you'd be fried instantly. Yes. It's kind of like our Super Soldier program, the scientific experiments that gave us Captain America. Well, the Skrulls tend to force their volunteers into service, rather than asking their permission. Some of their Super Skrulls have been less than happy once the procedure's done. Hey, anytime. Welcome back. You did a good job finding the McCran Crystal. Dugan has come to Adelan, and from his report, things don't look good. Entire landscapes have been converted into Doom's twisted view of perfection. He's gone to a great deal of trouble to make a mockery of former hero bases. The X-Mansion, the Baxter Building, even Stark Tower haven't escaped his notice. Every attempt to stop Doom has met with dismal failure. Dr. Doom's done worse than defeat them. He's converted them into his own private army. There appears to be nothing on Earth that can stop Doom. Any time at all. Do you require assistance? Black Bolt. He is unable to speak. Because his voice is so powerful, even the slightest whisper would destroy half of Attilan. Not if he can help it. He and his wife Medusa have developed a special sign language that allows them to converse. 
Your trip across the universe to Shi'ar was no trouble for him at all. No, he is as full of energy as ever. I don't know if teleporting tires him at all. I am happy to be of service. Welcome back from the Shi'ar Empire. How can I help you? The planet is quite important, as it is home to the Scroll Empress. It also houses the main research center for the Super Scroll program. Galactus is not the least bit concerned about the creatures on the planets he consumes. He is only interested in feeding his ravenous appetite. Yes, while she has proven herself to be an able leader, she is rather self-centered and egomaniacal. Quite often she is attended by two bodyguards, the Super Skrull and Pybok. The Super Skrull was augmented in response to the Fantastic Four. He has powers that are similar to theirs, such as super strength, fire manipulation, elasticity, and the ability to generate force fields. He is also the result of the Super Scroll program. He was given powers that make him capable of defeating Earth's superheroes. I am pleased to help. You're about to be sent to the homeworld of the Skrull. There you need to steal a device called the Muonic Inducer from Galactus, who is presently attacking the Skrull planet. Why is Galactus at war with the Skrull? He's not. Galactus is there to consume the planet. Whoa, this dude eats planets? I gotta get a picture of that. He doesn't really eat them. He has machines that convert the planet into energy he can absorb. One of those devices is the Muonic Inducer. I wouldn't think old Galactus is going to be too happy with us trying to steal one of his toys. No, he won't be. Which is why I'd strongly advise against any confrontation with him. Galactus is one of the most powerful beings we've ever encountered. That would explain why he feeds off entire planets. But how does he choose which worlds to consume? He has a herald for that. A scout who determines which planet's next on the menu. Well, at least we can count on the Skrull to help us out. Not necessarily. The Skrull are a warlike people who've attacked the Earth several times before. They'll most likely see you as enemies. Wonderful. So if Mr. Universe doesn't completely crush us, the Skrull will be happy to finish the job. Yes. Is that a problem? No. Just wanted to make sure what the teams are. Well, good. Now get moving. Team, you now stand on the Skrull homeworld. They are an alien culture who've tried to enslave humanity several times. They'll attack you, but remember, your primary goal is to locate Galactus so you can take his muonic inducer. Yes. Yeah, sure. Yes.
Team, it appears you're near a set of magnetic shield generators that Galactus uses. These devices convert the planet's magnetic field into a shield he uses to protect himself. On the off chance you'll have to face Galactus, it'd be in your best interest to take down these generators. There they are! Don't let the humans advance! You were almost a challenge. Warriors attack! Why not? Why not? Yes. I claim this victory for Asgard. The humans have been sighted! Good riddance. Don't let the humans advance! Stop the humans! Your attempts were weak at best. I grow weary of you. We need more troops! Troops, attack! You will spread in sales halls. Yes! Yes, got it! The battle is mine. The humans must be stopped. Freeze. Send more warriors. Oh! <laughs> 